how to forgive quickly that's what I want to share with you today forgiving is a huge blessing especially for the forgiver it's a huge blessing so word are three I'm gonna give you three quick steps to help you forgive quickly or quicker first seek understanding put yourself in their shoes so for example just think for a moment what have they been through are they angry because they've been abused are they mean to me because their parents were mean to them are they selfish because that's the way they were raised maybe they've only had a little maybe they grew up in poverty or again maybe they were abused and have very selfish parents secondly be humble remember we all have some type of shortcoming and have hurt others even if not on purpose so just remember that to be humble be meek and humble and remember that we all have hurt people so if someone hurt you and you find it hard to forgive them remember that we all hurt people even if not intentionally so and thirdly remember that to forgive is to set a prisoner free and that prisoner is you and so that's what I was saying in the beginning is that to forgive the biggest blesser the person who will be blessed the most is the is you is is the person that's was the victim or the one that was harmed or holding the grudge that's the person that's going to be blessed the most when you forgive and so that's what you want to do and so to forgive is is a great feeling i recall times not being forgiving toward my husband and just when we would have little arguments or spats or big arguments but especially little arguments quote unquote little arguments and I remember being angry with him for days and just not feeling good and so because I have committed myself into forgiving him faster or quicker I have more peace in my life and so I make sure I don't go to bed at night I don't go to sleep if me and him had a spat regardless of whose fault it was or especially if I snapped at him and said some bad words or just said some things I regret I'll text him and say I'm sorry or I'll say give me a hug because I don't want to have that those bad feelings it really is not a good feeling to not forgive there's a lot of tension when we don't forgive and we don't realize it and we walk around um, being edgy you know we walk around being edgy it's easier for people to push to push our buttons and so that's why we want to forgive because we're setting ourselves free from a bondage that we don't have to carry unless we choose to and so that's who that's who you're blessing that's who's going to be blessed the person that forgives and so then you attract when you forgive you attract positive fruitful things into your life when you forgive and so forgiving is a huge it's a huge blessing it's a huge virtue it's a very, it's a virtue. People who forgive, they go far in life. They're very successful because they're not carrying this extra weight. And they attract positive vibes from other people. They attract successful, productive people, members of society towards them. And so it lifts them up. When we forgive, it lifts us up. And it helps us to lift other people up. And then it's just a cycle. We lift people up. People lift us up. And just back and forth. So forgive. 
Just forgive. Remember those three things. And forgive. Don't allow yourself to be held back or held down or to be burdened because you won't forgive because you're the one that's going to be blessed the most from it. And so forgiveness is a great thing. It comes from great people. Great people forgive. They are very forgiving. We all are amazed by stories or when we hear someone that forgave someone that did something terrible to them or their family member. I remember seeing videos where a lady, a mother forgave someone who had killed her child. And she said on national television, I forgive them. And that's why I was on national TV, because people were amazed. And so she got a bunch of po positive feedback because she forgave. So forgiving is huge. It, it, it shows our character. It, it uh, shows nobility in the person. It's a beautiful trait to have, to be forgiving. And so that's what I do. And when I can't forgive, when I have a hard time forgiving, I won't say I can't forgive because I don't believe there's anyone I have not forgiven that I'm aware of. But when I can't forgive, I go to God in prayer and I ask him to help me forgive. And he does. I ask him to give me a forgiving heart. To forgive is a trait of love, of true love. To forgive. So that's what I want to encourage you today, to forgive, to forgive. And you will see the burdens, your wings will be open and you will be able to fly when you forgive. And the blessings will just come flowing your way. Countless blessings will flow into your life when you forgive. You can do it. You can do it. Yes, you can. You can forgive. Just keep trying. When you hear a negative thought about someone that you haven't forgiven, just say, I forgive them. I love them. I forgive them. God bless them. God bless them. And sooner or later, you'll be able to forgive. And those negative thoughts, they will stop entering your mind in a matter of time. So forgive. 